And you'll see that as I change these controls on the CC64, they also change on the screen in real time. At the bottom of the programming window, we have our Bank 1, 2, 3, 4, Selector, and Custom tabs. If I switch to Bank 2, you'll see the Membrane Switch Illuminate for Position 2, and I have four more rotary encoders that I can program. I have four rotary encoders on each of four banks, and then on the controller, I can step through those banks using the membrane switches. On the Selector tab, I can program the rotary encoder in the top right corner. Switching back to offline mode, I can go to my parameter sets, grab a parameter set, drag and drop it onto that encoder. Select another parameter set, drag and drop it on. I've now assigned four parameter sets to that encoder. Once I send the file to the device,